So far this year, Sandals has flown in travel agents from Boston, New York, and Chicago to its property in Exuma, in the Turks and Caicos Islands, and in New Providence. And on Saturday, it was a group of 174 coming out of Philadelphia, gracing the shores of Exuma to take a look at the Sandals Emerald Bay property. Our Julian Gibson tells us the four-hour stay at that resort will reap benefits for Sandals. Sandals Emerald Bay manager Jeremy Button says that all of the travel agents visited the resort in the past. Well, it has been a costly venture, but it is a plan that has paid back. We wine and dine them. Um, it, it, it takes a lot, but you know, this is a very important time of year because this really is the booking window. It's coming into the winter season now. Um, travel agents are at their busiest. The best way that they're going to sell a product if they, is if they experience a product. So that's why we bring them down. We only have them for a short period of time. Um, we involve the Ministry of Tourism. They come in, share with them um, the experience of Exuma. It, it, it really, it's a huge amount of work to put it together. It costs a lot of money, um, but it really does showcase Exuma and Sandals. Now for tourism manager Petarina Hanna, it was not only great for Sandals, but for the whole island of Exuma. They should first of all be applauded for such a bold initiative by inviting thousands of individual travel agents from dozens of cities throughout the U.S., continental U.S. and Canada to get just a slice of Exuma. This means that thousands of agents return to their prospective homes and they can invite their clients to visit Exuma from a personal perspective. Because once you've, once you've visited the destination, your selling becomes much more easier. So we are looking forward to reaping the benefits of these mega farms for years to come. That means local taxi drivers and hotel workers and restaurants and water sports operators, everybody will benefit from, even, from this kind of initiative. How much of them get mad with you say, oh, I'm only here for a couple hours, I wanted to spend a night for a couple of days? Plenty. And you know, it's the biggest compliment when they are all mad because they don't want to leave. And it, it, trust me, in two hours' time, when I have to get them to leave, it's the hardest part of the day. Reporting for the ZNS News Network, I'm Julian Gibson. I'm jealous of those travel agents. They got lobsters on the grill and everything. Well, I had an opportunity to stay, so I'm totally not jealous. Okay, Kendia, we let's not talk about that.